So, um, it's been a month since it snowed. You might remember a video was walking on ice. Well, that very same pond, you could just go check out that video and see the level of the pond. Compared to the level of the pond, I'm just going to show you. Take a look. All the snow is melted, except for the parts in the shade, like the majority of the snow is in this area. There, in the shady areas. Just a little teeny tiny bit out there in the garden. And the pond has risen to a level that's giving us danger of flooding. Um, now not the kind of flood that will overfill but right now it's cloudy and if by chance it starts snowing or raining and the pond starts filling up. The day I made that video stepping on ice, the pond was there. So in a couple of days it extended from that, you know that end of the stick, to all the way there. That's already flooding. At the center, it's about 10 feet deep, which is dangerous. And so here it's about a foot deep already. Now this is very dirty water since it's stagnant. And you can the looks uh, covers the subject and the skies are cloudy wow what a wonderful shot of the bird and if this it now looks like a river I mean it's so long there's still snow on that side but the snow on this side melted and all the snow melted and guess where it went the level is high right now a little increase like just about two three feet is flooded is a flood basically but uh, it's getting absorbed like <clears throat> the water has increased so much since the last time I saw it that I'm surprised is this even the same lake pond whatever it is full of water above the height of my head it's about the height of this tree uh, yeah. um, don't get me wrong this is not the highest it has ever been but obviously it's the highest I've ever seen um, I wish there was a way to check how deep it was but I'm not going in there I doubt even a boat can travel in the waters with so much grass in them. It's filled to the bottom with grass, which makes me wonder. Is most of the volume grass? But then again, no. It's a vehicle. Ah. So that was pretty much and I have to say, um, so the water will eventually cover all this. When that part, when that snow melts, the water level is going to rise so much that this would almost be an accurate representation of the Antarctic ice melt. The ice is melting, collecting, and then it'll, if it rains a lot, it's going to cover all this area. Yeah, it's pretty dangerous. So, I'm Diane from the Everything Channel. That's all for today. Goodbye.